Has anything really changed with BIM? I recently had a very edifying conversation with a professor about BIM. Now here's what he suggested. Nothing has really changed with BIM in the past decade. And I think he is right in so many ways. Software is very similar. Yes, we've seen many updates as companies are looking for ways to bring BIM to the field. But for the most part, not much has really changed since BIM was first introduced. And I'm gonna go a step further. The process hasn't really changed much either. And to be more specific, we've seen or defined many BIM manager roles, but as Cliff Moser really cleverly wrote in the most recent issue of Construct, now let me read this to you because it's really interesting. He says, if you are following that BIM execution process plan, you're still dropping handwritten notes in the typing pools in basket. So think about this, both process and technology need to change. BIM was a big disruptive force 10 years ago. It turned the industry truly on its head. Companies scrambled to implement it, but not much has changed since then. But why? I think if it starts with the data integration, many of the software and hardware systems still don't speak the same language. In fact, 69% of organizations are manually re-entering data from application to application. And this is research from McGraw-Hill that says the inability to share data is holding back BIM greatly. Simply, or perhaps even more importantly, we need to come together as an industry to address this challenge to make BIM the most effective tool it can truly be from the office all the way to the job site. Perhaps the government needs to get more involved. We know the UK government has a task force that is driving the use of collaboration 3D BIM on projects. And here's the interesting thing. We see the government is taking an interest in the IoT cybersecurity. We're all painfully aware that we need to address the lack of interoperability before we can truly take advantage of all this collaboration. Perhaps this is the first really big step in taking BIM out of its decade-old shadows and moving BIM forward. That's your Learn It for today.